And now the pitch where ad agencies compete to sell the unsellable. This year, all pitch challenges are coming from you, the Gruen audience. Tonight, we thank Adelaide's Jim Stapleton for his controversial suggestion. In fact, for the first time in four seasons of Gruen, we had agencies decline to take a shot at it. No one had a problem when we wanted to bring back child labour, invade New Zealand or euthanise everyone over 80. <laughs> but this idea scared people. So what does Nothing much, just the campaign to ban all religion. Can our agencies do it? Please welcome from Loud and Clear, Ben Abeath, and from Play, Simon Hurroff. <laughs> ben, did you receive divine intervention? No, it was, uh, it was tough. Um, we started thinking about all the other ideas that over the course of human history have seemed like a good idea at the time, and then had a use-by date, and we kind of took it from there. Let's have a look. For every human achievement, there were ideas that were never meant to last. Ideas that got left behind as mankind evolved. We worshipped the stars and believed the Earth was flat. We kept people as slaves and banned them from voting, especially if they wore a skirt. We believed in ships that couldn't sink and let colour... Almost. Bad ideas. And let's make religion history. Good job. Simon, did you have a road to Damascus moment? That Australia would be a happier, safer place without it. Let's have a look. Religion. Throughout time, the number one cause of conflict. Wow. Two of our best, I reckon. Russell, uh, which one did you prefer? Uh, I, they're both fantastic. But I just want to take religion history because of the demonstration of all the other beliefs that have become be beliefs no more. So I thought that was terrific. Uh, Bridget? I really like the thought of putting a bit of science behind something that's make-believe, like religion, in my opinion. So I really like the first one of tying, tying it on to something. Well, I don't believe in imaginary friends, personally, but tying it <laughs> to something that's very factual and making you think, actually, why are we believing this? So I go with number one, although both were really strong. Excellent answer, and also took a little bit of the heat off these guys. Uh, <laughs> uh, Sunita? Um, look, I'm going to go for number two. I, f I think the whole uh, subject is very emotional, and in order to be persuasive, the second one with the imagery and the tone um, was a bit more, more persuasive for me. And finally, Todd? Yeah, I, th I thought they were bo both good in a, in a bad way. Uh, and uh, I, I think that the second one was, for me, far better, because it did actually make you question and link religion to all the things that nobody likes. And which I think means that it's a tie. Congratulations to you both. Thank you. Your God might have other views. Tell us at the website and check out interviews with Ben and Simon where they read us chapter and verse on the making of those ads. The Gruen Transfer. Happiness made simple.